closing, I'd like to leave you with just a couple of tips. Number one, of course, we talked about snaking the lead pipe out to clean it. That really should be done at least every three months, as that's the point where the most debris builds up in the instrument. You can simply remove the first valve and snake the lead pipe out and rinse it with water. And always, when you've cleaned the valves, before you put them back in, remember to use the snake to clean the lead pipe. Another note is don't use Vaseline on your slides. As we talked about lubricants, grease shouldn't melt at a low temperature. Vaseline is often recommended, however, it's not a good choice. It melts at a very low temperature, and when this melts, it can flow into the valves and cause you more trouble. These instruments these days are very expensive, and we want to take the best care of our instrument that we can so that we get the most life and use out of it. Uh, please don't be scared to take your instrument and do the work. As you get into this over the years, it will come easier and easier, and you'll find that very often you can take care of a problem that you might have thought originally that only a repairman could handle. Also, if you'll do minor repairs as you go, there will be fewer and fewer instances of major problems. We never know what night in the middle of a performance a valve may stick or some minor problem will occur. So it's best that we start training ourselves and learning to take care of these problems because someday you're going to need these skills and there won't be a repairman available. I hope this video has helped you in this area and I'm anxious that you will use this and let me know if you ever see me of anything else that I may help you with on this area of repair. We tried to cover the basics here. There's much more to be learned, but through the years you will pick up on several tips that will help you in all this. Thank you.